So for question B, when you have limit x approaches infinity, try to substitute your infinity. When you substitute infinity, infinity times 3 minus 1, infinity. Infinity squared times 60 minus 9, also infinity. So IBF. So what we need to see here is how you simplify the limit infinity for IDF form. So you have square root. Alright, so we will follow the square root. So under the square root, you can see you have the highest x is x squared. So we are dividing square root x squared. So together under one third under the same square root, divide by x squared. So what's the problem is when you're dividing 3x minus 1, this one is without square root. So if you simplify, it is modulus. The simplest form will be positive x and negative when it greater than 0 or less than 0. So your x is approaches negative infinity. So supposedly, you have a negative here. When you're dividing your x, you have a negative here. Whether your negative is outside, already factorized out, or together with x. Then only we simplify this. Then substitute your infinity. 1 over infinity is 0, square root 9 over infinity also 0.